Watch you guys, got another video here for you. In this one we're going to be taking a look at this hard drive caddy where we can replace a laptop CD DVD optical drive with a hard drive or an SSD drive. Now this version is for 12.7 millimeters. They do other versions as well for different size laptops and uh, it, it's about six dollars believe it or not for this uh, aluminium uh, type unit which uh, will change out the DVD optical drive so if you have no use for an optical drive no more you can swap it out with one of these and put a hard drive or an SSD drive in its uh, place now that's great for storage and that's what we're going to be doing in this video so as you can see here it comes with its own little screwdriver and its own little caddy here so all we need to do now is uh, offer up our uh, SSD drive or hard drive and then slot it into the location and then we can remove the uh, DVD, op DVD optical drive from the laptop. Now this is great if you already have changed out the hard drive for an SSD but now you want extra storage and this is going to allow you to get that extra storage. So we have an SSD drive here as you can see this one's a Samsung one you can use whatever brand you like. And all you need to do here is just slot it into the location here Now it's not fixed into location at the moment, we need to put the screws on the side in so we can uh, tighten this up so it doesn't move about or fall out of the actual uh, caddy here. And the screws already are on the side which I'll show you in a second but we can change that facial plate as well and this is a universal device which allows us to use our original facial plate on the laptop. So here we have our caddy. You can see the little black screws on the side here. Just get your little screwdriver, which comes with the actual unit, and then just tighten these down. And this will stop it moving about. Now, I think for the money, this is awesome if you have no use uh, for an optical drive anymore, and you've got a laptop that you want to swap it out for. And again, it isn't going to cost too much if you've got a, an SSD on our drive lying around. So what we're going to do here is just test this as you can see, it's in location, it's not moving about, I'll push the bottom here to see whether it's going to move about and you can see it's pretty tight in there. So now next up what we're going to do here is remove the actual uh, optical drive from the laptop. This is pretty straightforward, this is normally just one screw and sometimes they're hidden but it's pretty straightforward, just unscrew this uh, screw and the optical drive should be released. So we're just going to undo this screw and it should just slot out. It's pretty easy to do. There we go. And uh, what we can do now is take the facial plates off of this one if we want to and use it on our new caddy. And we'll do that in a second. As you can see here it does come off. These are just clipped on. So you can see here, we can slot this into the location here. And it's exactly the same shape. It might be a little bit tighter, uh, but it should go into location. Just give it a little firm push to make sure that the connectors on the end of it are pushing home. And you can see here now, that's firmly in position. Now the problem you're gonna have if you use this facial plate here, it's missing the bottom part, and that's because it's not quite the same as the one on the laptop. So we're gonna change this out for the one that's actually on the optical drive. So just remove this and you can see the little lugs here that we're going to be using. And because this is a universal unit, it should actually s slot into place very easily. So let's just remove this facial plate here. Should just clip off. Could have done this before we put it onto the uh, laptop, but it doesn't really matter. All we need to do now is just clip this into location and that's pretty much it. And there you go. You've now got yourself extra storage inside that uh, optical bay and it's pretty awesome. I like it and for the money it's pretty cheap too. Now if you've already swapped out your uh, drive on your laptop you can already use that drive and put it into the optical bay. So let's fire this up and see what it looks like. I'm just going to quickly fire the laptop up. And once we get this done, we should be able to see our drive in here. So let's go to this PC. And there you go. There's our drive. 
we can access this if we want to and put all our data on there. Now also uh, what we can do is take a look at disk management and you can format this and uh, do what you like with it, partition it, do all your normal uh, stuff with this if you wanted to. I'm just going to leave this as is for now. Uh, but basically you can format this and partition it out to what you like. Now to remove this uh, drive, it's pretty straightforward. You just uh, reverse the cycle, just put your screwdriver in here, slot it out, and then just replace it. It's pretty straightforward. There you go, it just pops out. And now pull this out of its uh, bay here. And that's pretty much it. So I hope you uh, enjoyed this video, guys. I hope you found it useful. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Thanks again for watching, guys. Bye for now.